Hey everyone, welcome to Fishing Urban Ontario. And for this video, I'm gonna be giving all of my viewers an inside look at the urban city brook trout streams that I like to fish and the ones that I know about and can travel to easily. So many people search for these spots and they do the footwork and they do the hiking and they just can't find them. I won't be sharing the location of these streams with anyone, but I'll be showing you what they look like and what an average day of brook trout fishing looks like for me. I scouted out one stream that I'm really looking forward to fishing. Uh, I scouted it out the day before opener and it was just stacked with brook trout. And I'm going to take you guys after that to another two streams that I like to fish. So stay tuned, keep watching, and let's go get some fish. First one of the day, guys. There he goes. I'd say he's about a solid eight inch, maybe even nine inch rookie. So that was my first spot there. There were less fish in there than there were two days ago. Uh, so that tells me someone probably ransacked it or hopefully all they did is they just migrated throughout the, the stream. Anyways, we're gonna go to the second spot now and uh, I'm looking forward to it. It's a beautiful place. Uh, it felt really good to get those two brookies back there, but let's keep on going. So supposedly I stock this place every year with trout. So I'm gonna put on something with a barb just because it's stock trout. They don't last anyways in my opinion. What do you guys think, pink or white? You know what guys, I think I'm going with pink. They're rocking it. <laughs> No, man, I don't think they stocked it this year. So, uh, no one got anything yesterday. Uh, trout, there's native brook trout in here, but they're kind of rare because, you know, they're brookies. 
but when they do stock it you get rainbows and browns yeah no one got anything but <laughs> oh, I did not lie down on the floor to grab a little chub. This is ridiculous. Yes. Oh, yes. Thank goodness. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that would be Brookie number three for the day. Let's get a nice photo and release it quickly. Hey everyone, so I think that's a wrap for the video. Uh, you hope you guys got to see what our urban Brook Trout Creeks are like, and just how a typical day of fishing goes. You know what, I tried three creeks, I got three brookies. Whatever. It, but compared to even a few years ago, it's not what it used to be. Like, spots used to have more brook trout, used to be able to go out for an afternoon and get a nice 10 to 11 inch or now, that's such a challenge. But the thing is, not everyone has the time in the day. Just go two to three hours up north for the brook trout. So it is, the upside is it's close, it's convenient, and you can get that species of fish that you're after. So uh, thanks for watching everyone. Feel free to check out the channel and see if there's any videos that you would like to watch and if you want to subscribe, of course. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching.